guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Stephanie and today we're gonna be doing a makeup hack video. I don't know why I just chopped. Hack sounds like this motion. You know what I mean. So the makeup hack is the one that's supposed to give you like the most flawless skin ever, especially if you have oily skin. And girl, I got combination skin, okay? It means oil, dry, everything. What are we gonna do? Powder under our foundation. So what it's supposed to be is primer, then powder, then foundation, and then powder, I guess. And it's supposed to be better coverage as well. Like, it gives your foundation more coverage. If we can stretch our foundation a little further, like, nothing wrong with that. The products I'm gonna be using today are Smashbox Studio Finish Primer, Too Faced Born This Way Foundation, Laura Mercier Setting Powder. Put on some primer. Usually I just rub it in my T-zone. Now we're taking the powder. Ooh, this feels slightly naughty. It's a hack, let's give it a chance. So taking this big, big fluffy brush. From my understanding what I saw, you're not supposed to put that much light cover on your skin. Now I'm going to use the foundation and a sponge brush. Um, the sponge brush also isn't that wet. It's barely damp. When I wet it too much, I just end up looking greasy. So counterintuitive. That's not what we want. It's gross. Ew. Guys, if this works, I am going to be happy as a clam. Let's cover up spotty up here. Okay, is it just me or this foundation way too light for me? Like, did I actually get some sun here? I'm shocked. Regardless of it being way too light for my face, um, the coverage, I actually had to use less than I usually do. Okay, now that that's on, I'm gonna go back in with the powder again. That's what I'm supposed to do, but maybe it's the lighting. Maybe hopefully it looks good on camera. I'm actually gonna finish my face just to see how this looks all together because I feel like this looks way too ghosty, but maybe by the time I finish with my normal routine, um, it'll be better. So we're just going all the way. My face is already too light. Let's add some more lightness. Oh, fuck yeah. Makes sense. This is also supposed to make your contour go on more smoothly. So let's test that out too. We're already here. I'm not sure, but you know what? Actually, yeah, it does. I do feel like it actually looks smoother than usual. So winning. Okay, I can't help myself. I'm totally going to use highlight. I'm gonna take my Becca Cracked Highlighter that I love oh so much and I will never let go. Fan fluffy brush. I was watching a couple other YouTube videos and I believe it was uh, Laura Lee that said specifically if you have oily skin like refrain from putting highlighter like in this area which I, I mean it makes sense once you think about it. You're gonna look like a greasy mess in a couple minutes if you're already a greasy mess without makeup. If you put highlighter here and it's gonna be like a shine ball. But it wasn't obvious to me. So in case some of you don't know. Um, place the highlighter just in this area. Don't go any further than that. And then a little bit on my nose. On my lips, I use Marc Jacobs Kiss Kiss Bang Bang and the NYX Stockholm Pencil. I also used the Smashbox Insta Matte because the, um, the lipstick that I use, the Marc Jacobs lipstick I use, is actually a cream lipstick and that's what this works on. And I'm really happy with the outcome. I, I like how it made it matte. However, one thing about this thing is that like, that is the only thing that makes matte. It's like a one, one kind of lipstick transformer as opposed to like a full on lipstick transformer. I really hope this shows up well on the camera because I love this. Like, I am, I am so happy. I, I feel like I just learned a new way to put on my freaking makeup. So, it's all right. If you guys try it out, let me know how it went. Um, I feel like for me, as a oily combination skin person, this is gonna be like my new holy grail. Okay guys, that was my first makeup hack video. I had a lot of fun filming. I hope that you enjoyed it. Um, if you're gonna try it out, awesome. Let me know how it goes. And until then, I will be uploading another video in a couple of days. I hope you guys have a fantabulous, fabulous, fantastic, awesome, wonderful motherfucking day. Okay guys, I'll see you later. Bye.